Whether you have recently purchased a new Fire Stick, Fire TV or Fire Cube, or have been using them for a while, there are specific settings you should be aware of to protect your privacy and prevent Amazon from tracking your activity and analysing your data for targeted advertising. Even if you have already done this before, it's always helpful to have a quick refresher as Amazon constantly sends out software updates and changes to Fire TV settings without users noticing. In this video, I will help you prevent being tracked and ensure your Fire Stick works to its full potential. Let's take a quick look at the settings you must check and turn off to keep your information safe and secure. It's really important to protect your sensitive information while using the internet. The good news is that NordVPN can help keep your data safe and secure. Plus, Nord is more than just a VPN, with added benefits such as freeing you from any streaming restrictions. Don't miss out on the best VPN deal available right now. Check out the links provided in the description to get started and stay protected. The first thing we can look into is not exactly a tracking problem, but it can be annoying. This is the home screen of Fire TV, and as you can see, the top half of the screen is filled with advertised and sponsored content. If you push the directional button up on your remote, a video or trailer will automatically begin playing. Now, I don't mind this as I can watch a trailer and decide if a movie or show is worth watching. However, it might be more annoying for some people. In that case, you can change the settings to stop videos from auto-playing. Now, unfortunately, you can't completely get rid of the ads unless you install a custom launcher to replace your home screen with something new. I won't discuss custom launchers in this video, but if you want to learn more about them, I'll leave a link to one of my other videos in the description below. If you do want to stop videos from auto-playing, head into your Fire TV settings and tap down to Preferences. Select Featured Content and turn both options off to stop audio and video content auto-playing when you tap up from the home screen. Going back into Preferences, let's look at the privacy settings, which are crucial if you want to prevent Amazon from tracking your activities. These settings are usually related to advertising and other purposes. First, we have Cookie Consent, which uses cookies and device identifiers to show you targeted ads. If you don't want cookies to track your activity, tap the Decline button to turn this option off. Next, Device Data Usage collects your personal data to improve Amazon products and services. To prevent your Fire Stick activity from being tracked, turn this option off. App Usage Data collects information about the apps you download, how you use them, and how long you use them. This information may be shared with third parties such as developers. If you don't want your app usage to be tracked, turn this option off as well. Finally, interest-based ads generates an automatic advertising ID for your device, which is used to build a profile on you for advertising purposes or to show you interest-based ads. Turn this option off if you don't want your data to be collected and used for targeted advertising. The next setting to turn off is relatively new and you may have already watched my detailed video on this topic. If you haven't, I'll leave a link to it in the description below. Whether you choose to turn this off or not is entirely up to your personal preference. It's called Automatic Offload and it is designed to offload unused apps when your Fire TV device is low on storage. 
This feature allows your device to automatically uninstall apps that haven't been used in over 60 days while keeping the app data. This means that if you have made any changes to the app preferences or signed in with a username and password, this information will be saved in case you want to reinstall the app and use it again. Although it can save space, some users may not find it useful. If you wish to turn it off, go to your Fire Stick settings, click on My Fire TV, then About, Storage, and finally, click on Automatic Offload to turn it off. Returning to the Preferences settings, you'll find the Data Usage Monitoring option. This feature is useful only if you have a limited internet data plan or data cap. It helps you keep track of your data consumption by monitoring how much data your apps are using and warning you when you're approaching your data limit by creating a data alert when your data consumption reaches 90% and 100% of your set limit. If you don't have a limited internet plan, you can turn this feature off as it won't be of any use to you. This last setting is a matter of personal preference, but it can be quite annoying. It's the clicking sound that you hear every time you navigate around your Fire Stick. If it's driving you crazy, don't worry, there is an option to turn it off for a more peaceful browsing experience. Simply go to Settings, select Display and Audio, choose Audio, and then navigate to Navigation Sounds to turn it off. I hope you found this video helpful and it covered all the settings you should look at on your Fire Stick, Fire TV or Fire Cube. If there are any others that you'd like to change or turn off, let me know in the comments below. As always, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button, comment and subscribe to my channel, making sure that you turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any of my latest releases. These small actions from you make a big difference to me and helps to improve how YouTube recommends my videos to potential subscribers. And I truly appreciate your help in making my channel grow. Don't forget that online privacy and security are more important now than ever before. And NordVPN is an excellent choice. I use it almost every day to help me unblock internet restrictions when streaming such as this. With NordVPN connected, I can watch the content I enjoy from anywhere. You can easily download and install NordVPN's user-friendly app on all your devices, including Fire Stick, by searching for it in your app store. With NordVPN, simply connect to any one of their servers to ensure that your online activities are unrestricted and protected from prying eyes and potential cyber threats. The Nord app has some very useful features for your Fire Stick, including threat protection to help keep your device safe from potential security threats by blocking access to malicious websites. Plus, AutoConnect makes connecting to a secure server a breeze by automatically connecting to a network without having to manually do it every time you want to use the internet. Split tunneling lets you choose which apps or websites use the VPN connection and which ones use your regular internet connection. These settings and features are essential for anyone who wants to have a secure and personalised online experience. Check out the links in the video description for the best deals and try it now completely risk-free for 30 days.